Gentlemen, <laughs> what are we doing today? Partner meeting, end of the year wrap up. How's it going? It's going great. So far, so well. So far, so well. Kelly, what do you, what do you, what do you guys think of Kelly's beard? I think that's gonna be the question for this vlog, right? What do don't, you think? Don't be a hater. Don't be a hater. <laughs> Fear the beard. So Cal, talk to us. What's going on? What's happening with Tiege, baby? My beard makes me look older. That's what is that what you want to know? You, you know, it's know not as gray stuff? as I was thinking it would be. Well, yeah, we, we had a great, great 2017. We had a great, great 2017, you know, and uh, What vlog is this? Gentlemen, welcome back to the Tiege Hanley, starting a business, building a brand vlog. This one, big number. How many? 115. 115. Wow. Get out of here. You can't be in this. <laughs> the, chem the chemist is here. He's hiding. So guys, things are things are cooking. Um, wanted to just turn the camera on a little bit. We've got a lot of stuff going on. But uh, why don't we just go around the, the table and talk a little bit about some of the big wins for 2017. Because that's kind of the end of the year meeting. <coughs> We're going over all that kind of stuff. Who wants to start? Well, I can start with you know a little bit more on the technology side. We we had a big win that we've it's, it seems like so long ago, but we've been on a new platform, Shopify, uh, with Recharge for our subscriptions uh, since uh, August, and that was a real big win. We feel like we've got uh, ourselves on real stable ground from a technology standpoint, and um, so that's going well. Um, we're looking now on on taking it the next level with a lot of different different features they're offering. Um, and then also on the technology front, we're doing, uh, we're trying to increase our conversions. We, we've talked a little bit about that here and there, and we feel really good about uh, a couple agencies we brought in to help on, you know, improving the website and its effectiveness in terms of conversions. So those are, those are the big wins I think this year. Kel, I think the big wins are that we're uh, we're still rolling along, and uh, as a company, we're all we're all a bunch of happy guys. <laughs> And no problems, you know, and um, we're fortunate to have you guys. What were some of the big of wins, though? Big so, wins, Kelly. Our biggest wins this year. You're talking about what we didn't our, win. Our not. biggest <laughs> wins this year were, was the fact that we were able to keep the, the wheels on the bus and we had no major issues with product. We got to a new vendor who we're really, really super happy with. So we're super consistent now on our product. We added great people to the team, yeah. um, really good people, you know, so we've got, a, we do have some bench strength to make us, uh, you know, allow us to reach our goals this year. Um, Rob, Aaron, and I are still loving each other, yeah. which is an important win. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> What do you mean? You expected anything else? Nothing less, I do. Hey. I do think the b biggest win is the people, though. We have great people with us now. Uh, we're adding to the team and we're continuing to add and we hopefully we have that same luck in uh, in landing the right guys and right right girls and people to uh, to join us I and mean, that's that's the deal yeah I think and the other the other big wins is that we've gotten like a little bit we kind of grown up a little bit take the, take taking the, the 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 training wheels off and we just have a little bit more structure to our business so we're able to kind of run it more efficiently right so we're no longer you know, what is the definition of a startup? I don't really know. We are still a startup in terms of age, but we just have more things in place that allow us to be a better business. More quality control, more control over operations, better control over finances. Yeah. You know, we're just doing things right, not totally by the seat of our pants all yeah. the time. The other big win is reducing shipping costs. The fact that yeah. we spent three to four months, and I know you went over this in the last vlog, Aaron, but we spent three to four months evaluating shipping costs before we made that decision. There was a lot of time in lowering our shipping costs in half to half of our country, you know, our, our top a countries, a lot of our countries. That was a major, major win. So um, I think that's great. I would say the biggest sign of success, though, this past year is that. Did you know this? Aaron actually has business cards no. from T-Shirt. <laughs> You've got them there? Yeah, let's not show my phone not number. Sure. Let's show, not show I'll my show, phone I'll number. I'll show the back. There you go. Hold on, hold on, wait, wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, nice, nice. <laughs> it's just it's just a sign of solidity, you know? Yeah. So I a lot of great a lot of great wins for us. There there's one more really worth mentioning. And that is that, um, you know, I know you guys are gonna find this hard to believe, but we've been working off of folding, plastic folding tables in our office um, for the last um, year. 
um, except for desks that we found on the loading dock last year that Tommy uses. And we've actually got some more space in ICNC. Um, we got more space this can we Can we week. take five minutes and just show them the space? Can we all go up there real quick? Sure, sure. Let's do it. All right, guys, so it's lunchtime at Tiege Hanley headquarters, and I wanna show you, honestly, one of the reasons I love coming to headquarters so much. It's a salad vending machine. Hey. <laughs> Kelly, there. talk to us. What is this thing, Farmer's it's, Fridge? It's lunch, it's lunch in a vending machine. Lunch. Well, look at this. In here, see if I can zoom in. You've got all these different salads that are made daily. And then you can like add like little additional things, like you can add like hard boiled eggs or you can add like chicken or anything like that. This is the coolest thing and it's all like touch screen. You have Southwest? You have Southwest? Me? I yeah. had a Southwest, yeah. yeah. yeah Look at that sweatshirt, Josh. Like, move, move those strings. What's up, Tom? Hey, how's it going, guys? All right, hey, I was hoping that you could sort of tell everybody and, and show them sort of what happens. How does the process of labeling everybody's sexy Tiege Hanley system work every day? Sure, so uh, we got uh, level ones on the table right now. So what we do is we print our labels in our three different levels. So level one, level two, and level three. Right now I'm going through and I'm putting labels on our level one boxes. And once those are all set up, we count them, make sure we got everything correct put them into some bins, or if it's a big day, we put them in a big APC, or if it's an even bigger day, a BMC, and then we send those bad boys out the door, they get picked up by USPS, and they get to you within about three to five days. So you do this for level one, level two, level three, yep. and then international as well. International is a little bit different, so we're gonna have a different colored box that we have, so we'll set all those up, and they go into these big DHL bags. So we have about a couple bags that we send out every day, they get picked up by DHL, and then they go international overseas everywhere we go to the ship. Tommy. Hey everybody. Let me see those shoes. Whoa, double monk straps. I love it. Tell the story about the double monks. So as a Christmas surprise we ended up going to Michigan Avenue and uh, Kelly took us shoe shopping. It was an adventure. Tom but why? I, why? Why double monks? I don't know. Apparently, I know the story. Because at the end of our vlog, I always say we love you more than our double monk strap shoes, Kelly actually took the team to buy double monk strap shoes. And so, got a sexy pair right there. What? And then, uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Josh has a pair upstairs. Um, they're black, but because we were we were coming here today and I haven't seen it, they surprised me and all wore their double monk strap shoes. So that is pretty awesome. But Tom, E, what's happening, Aaron? So what's happening? You tell me. You tell us, the guys, what's happening. This is the time of day where we print the international orders. We got all the DHL packaging labels firing off the machine right now. Everything going well, Tej? Everything's going great. We're pretty excited about this. Yeah, good 2017? We crushed it in 2017. We doubled our expectations and we're ready for more. And what do you think this year? Got... This year's gonna be insane, we need help. <laughs> <laughs> so in this building, like we talked about, um, it's three, there are three levels here, right? Three levels, and um, you know, we right now, Tiege Hanley headquarters is on level two, and Kelly had, for his old business, he actually leased another, another space, like right next door. Um, the space now that we have is on the third floor, and it's about the equivalent to both sizes of the other space. So it's like, how many, Kelly, how many square feet? 2,300. 2,300. And, um, and so it's great. Up here is just going to be offices. where We still need to figure out storage, and that's one of the main things that we're kind of discussing right now is, is what, what we're going to do because we've got, you know, orders of just like <laughs> massive, massive amounts of quantity and we just don't have enough place or enough room to store it. And so that's one of the issues and, and we're talking about like, like tons and tons of pallets. But this is the new space. Hey, what's that? <laughs> what's Stock Chicago? Uh, previous tenants don't know what to say. They're awesome clothing manufacturer, but um, they either graduated or moved on. I'm not sure which one, but they they left us this awesome space, and we are psyched. Look us around. Well, well, I mean, I guess the most important thing is right over here. Uh, yet to be unwrapped, 
Why is that still? Why is that not even? Why? Well, later when, this when, when, is the, when is the tournament taking place? The Brunswick sponsored table tennis match is going to occur. <laughs> Josh, are you good? I used to play, but I haven't played in a while. I have my racket. Your racket? Oh. It's not called a racket. <laughs> I don't know how good I am anymore, though. No? I used to play a lot. I like that sweatshirt, though. That's awesome, Josh. Where'd you get that? Do you have a sweatband? No. Josh, I'm not talking about I used to have a spot band. or anything, but they look like double monk straps. <laughs> oh, there they are! There they are! There they are! Oh, Check yeah. it! <laughs> Kelly, all right, I kind of told the story with, uh, with, with Tom, but tell the story of why you got him. He didn't know. Oh, why? Because du double monk strap. We love you more than our double monk strap shoes. Exactly. Come so you, you took everybody double monk strap shoe shopping. Shopping, that's right. Why not? We were. Me. Hold on, Kelly. Yeah. You got him? I've got him. Oh, double bunk. Rob, right. Rob, Rob. He didn't take me shopping. He, he didn't, didn't we need to take Rob shopping. Hey. Kathleen, will you say hello? Hello. So you want to say anything to the guys? This is kind of our thing. No, but I do want to say that game on on ping pong. Oh, game on. Have you enjoyed working here so far? It's been great. Yeah? Really, really good. Are we in trouble? No, everything is good. Yeah? Yep. Sure gonna be should, good. should we ask her about why she's got the, the window office? Yeah, why do you have the window office? <laughs> nice. <laughs> I'm special. I mean, you know, I mean, uh, chair. I mean, she's, she's one of the senior execs here. She, you know, I, I, actually, what's going to happen is Tommy's going to come up here, and since he's employee number one, he's going to get first pick. It's kind of like that that uh, secret Santa where you can steal someone else's oh, gift. Oh, she's just quicker. She's so just quicker. since he's she's since quicker. he's the first guy, he might end up. Taking she's her here. Spot. She's Kathleen P. <laughs> P to mark your territory around here. <laughs> <laughs> And so show us these fancy ass desks, Hell. It's your ass, man. What are you doing? So what's the story? You, you stand during the day? Well, I did. I was standing. I like to stand when I'm on calls. So I always pace. So this is, this is nice. Whoa. Nice. Nothing but the you best. Nothing but the best. There's, what's that? It's not just about your face, but it's about your body. And you got to stay in good shape. Yeah. And you burn 300 calories an hour standing. So we've been Is told that by, true? So, so we've been told by the guys that sold the guy, these expensive yeah. desks. The guy who sold the desk said you burn 300 calories an hour standing. Um, <laughs> don't believe that. <laughs> he was in very good shape. Yeah. Okay. All right. He was? So hey, we're, we're all, we're just trying to get, you know, we haven't really gotten uh, settled here, but. Okay, standing quietly, a 150 pound, I'm more than that, person burns about 114 calories per hour. So that's even, I'm assuming more for me. Yeah. If I have more weight, yeah. Absolutely, that's pretty cool. All right, Kelly, give yeah. us a rundown. How is this space gonna be laid out? So we're gonna have some conference tables over there. Um, we're gonna have a kitchenette area in, over in a little kind of entrance foyer. And then we, we're gonna have these things that are really cool. They're called huddle rooms. Many of you guys might have heard of them, but they're like modern day phone booths. You kind of can just go in there. There's like a little chair. You can plug your laptop in. They're silent booths. And, and like, you know, if you have to, if, if you know, you got something to say and you're upset with me about something, we can go in there and you can let me have it. No one else is going to hear it. Right? So we should, too bad we didn't have that this morning when we were talking, but hey. Um, and then we're going to have uh, a little collaboration space there with a big, uh, uh, board on the wall that we can write but on. Look at this, look yeah. at this. It goes up really tall. How, how tall is that, Kelly? You know, that's about 35 feet. And our architect, who's kind of just helping us make sure we get the plans and the space laid out to be really efficient, he's talking about trying to put in a mezzanine up here for us. So I don't know if that's going to happen or not. Guys, that's in the budget this year, but it'd be fun to do a little mezzanine. In but Africa. we've got the... Uh... We're all cowhide. I don't know how that all came together like that. But... <laughs> cowhide, we've got cow... Is that real? Like... Yeah, yeah, sure. Look at that Sit table. Sit down in there. Let me get huh? it for you. I, I yeah. think I can handle this. What do you think? Put your feet up. <sighs> there it is. All right. See, this, this is my type of office. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I mean, seriously, that is uncomplicated at its best. All right. Rob, Kelly, <clears throat> get over here. So everything, I don't know, what's, what's, okay. <laughs> All right, come over here, gentlemen. All right, so, so what is the, what is the plan for the rest of the, the week or the, the few days that we're going to be here? 
no, you know, <laughs> this is the third time I've said this to you guys. <laughs> if you don't know where you're going, all roads will lead you there. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Has he said that before? <laughs> yeah, he does. He does. I've never heard that. So we're just trying to figure out <laughs> the road we're gonna drive down in 2018 you know, and that's to, get one us, uh, to get us to where our goals that's are. That's one of the things, you know, we've, we've, you know, because of you, because of us, because of all of us, you know, we've been incredibly successful. Well, with success, you know, there, there are a lot of different avenues and options like to go. It's like, do we do this? Do we do that? Do we double down on, on what's been working? Or do we try new and exciting things and fun videos that we thought were gonna be funny that didn't end up being funny? We Dinner? We've got dinner, right? We've got dinner. Where are we going? We're going to uh, Steakhouse, <laughs> Chicago Steakhouse. We gotta go to Steakhouse, right? Keep going, stay it's our tradition, end of the year tradition, right? It is, okay, steak, a little bit of wine. A little bit of red wine, and uh, you know, we'll, we'll let Mr. Sommelier here pick out, you know, what, <laughs> what the wine is. And uh, I, I love like Carlo Rossi, the cheap stuff, man, Paisano. Last, last time we ordered a bottle of wine, he's like, Spit it back into his glass. I don't think he's I like so this. He's so lying. He's so lying. By the way, hold on. You you were busting on me for no mo double monk straps. What's going I've got on? Chelsea boots on. Chelsea boots. Oh, on. Are you breaking them out tonight? I don't have double. You didn't travel. With I didn't. I didn't travel. Oh, I traveled right. light. It's a quick so, trip. What's so, tomorrow? So, what are we doing tomorrow? Tomorrow we're working on all our marketing plans for next, for this year. Time so. to shop between then. <laughs> for, for you? Or so, me? what are we going to start saying? We love you more than our Chelsea boots. Yeah, Chelsea yeah, boots are pretty sweet, too. You know what, no. I think the guys will like it because off yeah. with the monk straps and now they get a pair of Chelsea All boots. Right. So. <laughs> this is falling apart quick. Yeah. Guys, just wanted to quick film a quick little video. Is that, I can't hear. I sound like Kelly. Chicago. Yeah, I sound like <laughs> Kelly now. Aaron, take two. I wanted to film a quick video since I had them here and just, you know, let you sort of see what's going on. As you can tell, we're having a lot of fun. And that's really, at the end of the day, there's a lot of stress that goes along with, with running a business. But when you are having fun, you know, it makes it all worth it. And it, it's a lot less of a pain in the ass when you enjoy the people you're working with, the, the customers that you're interacting with, and the, the space that you're in. The space that you're in and the products that you're selling. And so this has been like, it's been like a, a wild ride. Huh? I'm wild? Wild. I'm We're wild. having so much fun, guys. So we much are fun. So grateful to you guys. All your engagement. I mean, we just, this guy, you know, gave us a tweet yesterday we never even heard before. He's telling us how good he looked. You know, I heard a guy in the gym last week told us about how I gave him a box for Christmas and came and said, man, what did you give me? My, my wife, my friends, they're all my family. Tell me how great my skin is. And those are awesome. We, and we said, we've got to meet every quarter. And, and I think it's a really good thing because you're, you're working so hard, so long. And it, sometimes it is good. It is good to think back at what you've accomplished in that time frame. Right. It keeps, you right. Going, keeps you going. All right. Well, we're going to be down at Menfluential Conference. And we're, oh, yeah. We're Menfluential really coming yeah, we're soon. Looking forward to February that. February 23rd and 24th. If you don't have your tickets, there are a few left. Yeah, and you'll meet Josh. Josh is coming down. Josh is coming. Josh. And, uh, and uh, it should be great. We're going to have a good time. We are going to have a good time. But, There's but, still a lot of work that's for me. that's a conference where you really do learn a lot. Yeah. So, no, it's yeah, awesome. It's a great conference. Guys, all right. we got a lot to do, and I will report back as to who is the official Tiege Hanley Ping Pong Champion of 2018. We love you more than our... We love you more than our double monk strap shoes. Right, Josh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, see you tomorrow.